bullet hits a three-year-old child sitting on a sidewalk in Englewood. That shooting as well, injuring six other people. CBS 2's Lauren Victory live right now at Comer Children's Hospital with more on the violent start to this weekend, Lauren. Suzanne, it's been a busy night for Chicago police. 15 shootings since 5 o'clock last night. Now, this shooting originally came in as only two people hurt, including that three-year-old boy. Later in the evening, police discovered that the gunfire in this one instant actually hit seven people who were out trying to enjoy the summer evening. Now, as first responders rushed that three-year-old to Comer Children's Hospital with a gunshot to his shin, other little kids toyed with crime tape back at the scene on 65th and March. Field. Detectives scoured Englewood lawns and pathways for evidence, and at this hour, they have not released specifics about what led up to the shooting. But they do tell us that six out of the seven people shot were simply sitting on the sidewalk when they heard gunshots and felt pain. A bullet grazed a seventh person in her backyard. Police sources tell us this area is known for gang activity, but it hasn't been linked to this crime just yet. Ogden Park is nearby, as well as Harper Heights school, a library, and a post office. The 7th District Police Station is only about a half mile away. Pastors are exasperated that their communities are becoming crime scenes. I don't know what the problem is here in Chicago. It's not not just values. It may be values, but values is not it. It's This is just a bad place right now, a bad place for children, a bad place for adults. Now, thankfully, police tell us that the little boy being, being treated here at Comer's is in, uh, his condition has stabilized. We're also told, though, that at least one adult is in critical condition because he was shot in the back. I'm Laura Victor reporting live CBS 2 News. Suzanne. Thanks so much, Laura.